Hi, I'm Megan Goods from Mindful Healing Toolkit and in this video we're going to be looking at self-doubt. So the first thing I want you to do is to get a piece of paper and I want you to take a time when you really doubted yourself and doubted your abilities or how you were feeling um, or you're doubting your abilities to make a decision. So just think of that time and write down a number out of 10 of how, how heavy that is. So is it a 10 self-doubt? Is it a 2 self-doubt? Okay, and that's really important so that we can actually test it later on once we've done our tapping. So write down that number, write down whereabouts you're feeling it in your body as well, and what feeling it might be. So if there is a feeling linked to self-doubt, if you're feeling anxiety or something like that, so write those three things down, and then we're gonna start doing the tapping. So we start on the side of our hand, and I want you to repeat after me. Even though I have this self-doubt, I'm going to accept myself as much as I can. Even though I have all this self-doubt, because I'm not sure I can trust myself to make the right decisions, I'm going to accept myself as much as I can. Even though I have all this self-doubt, I'm going to accept myself as much as I can. Okay, top of the head. All this doubt, the eyebrows, I'm doubting myself, side of the eye. Not sure that I can trust myself under the eye. I'm not sure I can make the right decisions. All this doubt. All this doubt. The collarbone. Not sure that I can make the right decisions. All this doubt. All this self doubt. Not sure that I can trust myself. I'm not sure that I can make the right decisions. Doubting myself. I doubt myself. All this doubt. Doubting myself. All this self-doubt. Okay, so what I want you to do now is just to take a deep breath. And I want you to think about that situation again. And I want you to see where it is now in terms of your rating. So rate it again out of 10. If it's a zero, that's fantastic. Um, if it's still there, then we need to go and do another round. Um, also write down whereabouts that emotion is. So sometimes the emotions can move in our body. So check where that is and check what emotion that is. Now this time I'm going to go through with you tapping and I'm going to get you to actually use your own words. So whatever you're doubting yourself about, I want you to actually add in the words, um, as I say. So I'll leave a space for you to be able to do that. Okay, so this part's really important and powerful for you to use whatever you're thinking. Okay, so even though I have all this doubt, I'm gonna accept myself as much as I can. Even though I have all this doubt, I'm gonna accept myself as much as I can. Even though I have all this doubt, I'm gonna accept myself as much as I can. Feeling, so put in the emotion. Feeling, all this doubt. I'm doubting myself because all this doubt. Doubting myself. I'm doubting because. I want you to keep going through and doing another round, do another couple of rounds if you need to, using your words. And then after you've done two or three more rounds, I want you to rate it again. Now, if you are finding that you can't get down to a zero, that could be because there are underlying um, or causes or issues or beliefs that need to be resolved. Uh, so if you need some extra help with that, then feel free to contact me. My website is www.mindfulhealingtoolkit.com.au. Uh, and we can use uh, a, a range of different uh, modalities and things to help you. So I don't just do EFT, I do a theta healing, access bars and, and a few other things. So um, I really can find uh, more powerful ways to help you to dig deep and find those underlying beliefs and issues and resolve them. So feel free to contact me if you need help, but otherwise keep tapping um, and make sure that you rate it as well, just so you can see sometimes we don't believe 
uh, what we are actually seeing when um, if it's not written down in front of us that we actually did feel an eight or a ten and all of a sudden it's a two um, so yeah so keep tapping until you're feeling better and I hope you have a great day